Hello everyone, welcome to a new video. Yep, this is Pen Light. Once again, you know, we are here to see what what will happen. Yeah, and sorry I've been, been posting Pen Light for like two weeks, but we are here once again. So uh I'm very very interested <laughs> about about this pen light story is actually getting even more more and more interesting so yeah and also guys i just wanted to say uh thank you for all the support from the recent videos i've got i actually got a bit of attention there and i really really appreciated you guys so uh yeah for the new people are watching here welcome to my uh new well well welcome to this channel <laughs> and yeah so let's start Okay, so this was the part where we had to choose. So, uh, one second, I need to see the comments real quick because I actually didn't see it. So, uh, so I saw. Well, there was only one person said it, like, uh, "Refuse to give up, give up the pen light." So we gotta do this. So uh, hold on, let me. The song is kind of too loud. Pretty sure for you guys or something, but for me, it is. <laughs> But anyway, refuse to give the pen life. Let's. There we go. Natsumi has been having doubts about all of this, and I guess tonight pushed her over the edge. But I can't. Natsumi, come on. Don't you think you're being a little dramatic? Oh, I can't let that stop. What are we doing? This really isn't a big deal as you think. We don't have to stop any of this. With you, Q, this is my decision. Oh god, I found this going to end very bad. We've come so far. We've got it so close to discovering the full potential potential of my pen light. I can't keep doing this to the people I love, so that's why. We've gotten so close to each other. That's why we need to stop using the that pen light. We can't ever use it again, you hear me? No matter what Natsumi may think, we can't stop what we started. Sure, things didn't go how we wanted and you're feeling the pressure, but everything's going to be fine, you'll see. Oh no! <laughs> no! Okay, keep. it's not going to be fine. If she doesn't want to, just let it be, alright? Just, just let it be. No, no, this is as far as we go. We can't use that thing anymore. We owe it to the ourselves to continue our experiments. Look, maybe you're right, but don't you think we should finish tonight's show first? Sniff. What? What do you mean? Tonight's hypnosis show isn't over. You know that, right? I... What are you talking about? Of course it's over. Closing the distance between us, I simply reached up to the pad the top of the Natsumi's head as her tearful eyes fixed me with the most bewildered expression. But I never said it was, did I? C Q, sleep. Uh, oh, oh, okay, <laughs> oh no, that's right, Natsumi. We both know how pers- oh god, what is that word? Persuasive hypnosis onto the pen light is pretty serious, but I'm wrong. So it's only natural that you are feeling back into this wonderfully deep state of relaxation. Only natural to fall so deeply back into trance for me. Oh god, Kyo, what are you doing? I rest her as I see the strength I leave her body, and her head slumps limply against my shoulder. My, pen, my pen light really is incredible, isn't it to me? You, shh! It's a rat. Oh, 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 guys, guys, hold on! I need to do something here real quick, cause you know, for the thumbnail, you know, for the thumbnail. There we go. Okay, let's continue. With a genuine emotion, I reached down to lift her up in my arms before carrying her carefully to rest. Jesus, to rest on her own bed while I continued to speak to her subconscious mind. I know you're having doubts, and I know you're scared, but you didn't really mean what you said just now, did you? I... I know you don't want to stop this, and so do you, not to me. So, I want to tell you, it's okay, you don't have to be scared of what happened, or what may happen. 
Instead, you can just relax, let all of those worries and doubts and concerns fall away from your mind. I mean, Q, I know you trying to die. You are trying to do something good, but at the same time you're doing something bad. That means you're forcing her to forget all of those worries and stuff. So I, I mean, it's a good thing, but also a bad thing at the same time. So I, I, I don't know. Let them all go and let me be scared of what. Let them all go and let me be scared for both of us. I'll take care of everything from now on. Okay, not to me. Ah. I smile as her expresses softness with a calm sigh while I wipe the tears from her face. Okay. Of course, it's okay. So, in a moment, you're going to wake up again from this wonderful state of trance, ready to continue everything we're doing together. Ready to awaken and let me worry about all of this in one, two, three. Awful. Oh, awful snow. And that's as far as I've gotten on this story path, I'm afraid. No! No! Stay tuned for more development on this in the later update. Okay, we continue. Well then, I guess we. <laughs> that was fast. Okay, so um, maybe let's try to use the other option. Give up the pen line. I can bear to see not me in this much pain. This pillar of mine, I may have built it, but I still don't understand how it does what it does. And as I rub my fingers around it, and I try to bend it in two, it seems I'll never understand. Natsumi wipes her eyes as she watches the pillar visibly bend in my hands, and when I go to click the switch, we see how it fills to light. So, that's that then. I guess this means our show is cancelled too, huh? I yeah. We know this isn't made. All that's left for tonight is to finish up downstairs. How are we doing down here? We returned to earlier. Uh, we returned to the living room to find Sayuri and Hiroko are still waiting for us. Fine, I was just wondering what you and Kiyo were talking about that you didn't want wanna loop me and on, me and on. Yes, yeah, sorry. It was a, a delicate subject. I can't help but chunk as I notice Hiroko still holding those loose socks in her fist. <laughs> yeah, you seem a little. Oh my God, preoccup preoccupied, preoccupied. <laughs> I hate reading. Kiyo, mind your manners in my house. Right, Hiko's not the only one I need to sort out while I'm here. Alright, both of you need to pay attention to me. I thought they both may have lost their hypnotic conditioning after I went upstairs. It's pretty clear we've finished our act after all. But I guess I should know by now that they won't let go on their own. I really do need to be direct with them. We're finished for tonight, okay? The show is over. That means you're no longer hypnotized and everything I said to you in your deep state of relaxation no longer has any effect on your behavior, understand? Why are you talking like we're a couple idiots? I know we finished finish up and in, in, up in here? Wait, what the freak am I doing with this? Giving them back before you develop some kind of sub fetish. Oh, uh, yeah, here you go. <laughs> I forgot. Oh, yeah, I forgot about that. <clears throat> Kiyu literally uh, made her Hugo, you know, force her to just steal other people's socks for no reason. <laughs> that was actually uh, pretty funny. <laughs> The room fills with a quiet laughter as our performance comes to an end for the good this time. If you guys are wondering why am I not editing so much in like in visual novels, you know, games, because I think it makes sense for not editing so people can pay attention what is you know what is going on to the text over here. So it would be kinda unfair if I edit so much and then you guys will be confused with section you guys are or which plot it's going on in this video so 
I think it's only fair for me not edit this video. So yeah. Now you know. Maybe I'll regret what happened. Just know up in Natsumi's bedroom. Knowing I broke the one thing that made all of this possible. But maybe it's worth it. Just to see her smile again. So when do I get my suck back? Uh, uh, <laughs> ah, mom. Miyago says Atsuko suddenly returns from the kitchen. Oh yeah, dang. The part. I forgot to watch the name she was mentioning. Uh, last episode, I really did forget. Uh, let me know in the comments. I really, I actually forgot. I may have read her of my penline assistant hypnosis, but I did do anything with her. Apparently, causes cause her. Oh, don't make those faces. I'm okay now. Seeing Hansuki again after all these years. Ah, oh, Hansuki. There we go. That's the name. That's the name. Who is Hansuke? It's like her. Uh, it's like. Hold on. Okay, hold on. I may have a fury here. Isn't Hansuke like. Is this like a, a boy's name or something? If it is, then maybe she's talking about. Uh, what's her name again? I keep forgetting. Oh, I, I forgot, but yeah, uh, maybe her husband. Maybe she's talking about her husband. Maybe they like separate or something. I don't know. Seeing Hansuke again after all these years was quite shocked, but I guess it was a little cathartic too. I always wanted to yell at that creepy old bastard. I still want to know who the freak this Hansuke guy was. Okay, it's a guy, so maybe, maybe it's her husband so i don't know there's apparently a f famous person that heard her 18 years ago okay maybe it's not <laughs> maybe maybe it's not oh no way oh my god i have a lot of fear in my head uh, but that <laughs> some of some of those are weird so i'm not going to say anything but i guess i know better than to ask right now so all i can do is bow my head I'm sorry, Atsuko. I really wanted you to have fun with everyone else. I know, dear. And it was fun while it lasted. It really was, but we're going to do something else for the culture festival. Wait, seriously? Oh, I hope that's not on my account. No. Well, okay. It is a bit. And I realize I don't feel comfortable performing hypnosis in front of everyone, so... She glances towards me as she says it. I guess that's about as truthful as she can be to everyone else right now. Right. I don't really want to do all this crap in front of people. Jesus. Alright, that's me. If that really is how you feel. But I don't want you regretting tonight. I'm happy you asked me for help. Uh huh? Just know I'll support you in everything you do, okay? Huh? Mamai. Oh, okay. Ew, this is a cute bee. Cute, cute, cute. A lot has happened since that day. Hey, 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 here you go. You know, you're looking good with that dress. You know? I, 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 I. No words. Also, I started a lot. <laughs> okay, I'll stop being freaking, I don't know, down bad guy. Here's your coffee, sir. Thanks for coming to our class, coffee. So, so now she's like, you know, doing the thing of coffee maid thing on the club or something. Looks like it. Like for the festival thing. Although one thing that didn't happen was our hypnosis show, which is why on that day of the culture fest we're all here serving drinks and snacks in our classroom. Yeah, seems right. Hello, not to me. How you doing? Okay, stop, Marco. Welcome. Please take a seat, whatever you like. Our classroom, having been transformed into a simple cafe for other students, parents enter 
occasional visiting member of the public. Oh, customer. Hey, did you hear me? Uh huh, huh. Here, what? Right. A classroom cafe that me and most of my class got robbed into helping with. And I'm supposed to be winning tables right now? I said I wanted a milk tea and some lemon cake. Oh, right, sorry. No, not gonna lie, Sire, you you looking kind of funny with me. <laughs> Please excuse him, ma'am. This is the first day. Severus went to smock you. Oh, I mean, coming right up, man. <laughs> okay, hold on. I need. An, oh, sh no, oh, God. I was about to say the, the S word. <laughs> you know what? You, yeah, I'm, I'm going to do this because why the hell not? There we go. Another thumbnail. That's how the day went, as we all saw to. To a busy lunch hour. It's not like we haven't done the school cafe thing before. Actually, our class has done this for the third year in a row. But this time it does feel different. Maybe because I'm out here talking to the customers this time instead of hiding in the back room. Back rooms? Okay, I'll stop. Maybe because I know me and not me had a sense to do something better. Or maybe it's because this will be the last time we all take part in the school culture fest together. I'm not sure how I feel about it all. Is this how it end? Oh, I, I okay. I have a feeling the end. The ending is almost there. I mean, there's there's a there's still a lot of option to do. Like very 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 like almost like in the beginning of the episode. There's still more to go. Thanks for coming to our class, Kathy. Have a great day. If we can relax a little now, here you go. The crowd started to, to thin. Oh, thank freak. I think my cheeks are gonna f fall off. That is a little too relaxed, here you go. Especially given our current clientele. Clientele. I don't know how to pronounce that. I was just saying, uh, she is a great our class voter. Did you. Um, I made a bottle of coffee for a culture fest again. I love serving customers and stuff. Good job, class. Love all free. There we go. I could not have said it any better than myself. Freaking kill me. <laughs> oh, yeah. I can't believe I've missed out on all this fun before waiting tables with you guys. Guys? He says. Right, most of the dudes in our class voted for this, then elected themselves for a kitchen and cleaning duty while the girls got cajoled into a dressing gums just like before. Yeah, I mean, I'm not surprised if you guys voted this. I'm almost single-handedly upholding the butler them, them here. Okay, bad choice of words on my part. Well, it's cool you, you stepped up anyhow. Sure, no problem. I mean, it's only fair after the other week, right? Huh, damn right it is. <laughs> uh, and uh, I'm just gonna say it. Hmm, say what? It's a damn shame we couldn't make the hypnosis show work. Huh? Okay, this is, this is very rare f coming from Hiroko like that. Hiroko? Are you insane? <laughs> yeah, like... Don't get me wrong or anything, I still think the hypno stuff's a little, like, weird and freaky. But, I don't know, it ain't very nice we all get to hang out and have some fun, you know? For a moment, no one says a word, as the clicking of cubs in place fill or silence. Well, for what it is worth, I happen to agree. You do? Okay, this is... This is, this is a big, big, big plot twist. <laughs> so it looks to not to me and seems to think carefully about her next words. I did not seem appropriate to mention it in all the time after what happened to your mother. And of course, we we have all been busy since then when our pre preparation for exams and she sighs and <laughs> gestures around her. Well, this. So I have not bad an opportune moment to comment before now. 
but I will admit I was impressed that the trio of you were able to come together, set aside your differences and put on an entertaining and thought-provoking performance. And you put it together at this short notice. If you had only allowed yourself the proper time to prepare, I dare say you would have made something very special. You really think so? Of course, of course now. I believe our servers are going to be needed again in short order. She points and the rest of us look to see a queer forming by the doors of our classroom. Uh, yeah, that's fudging great. Do you guys want to take a break? I can't handle this. For real? Don't give me hope like that, dude. Well, we do need to start thinking about breaks now that you're missing in the queue. We do. So, if you don't mind, I would like to go to go first. And I propose Hiroko join me, if only to rest her poor abused facial muscles. But yeah, I owe you guys. It's kind of it's kind of good to see the the good details in the background of you know people talking, and you know coffee drinking coffee and you know cup noises. It's actually pretty good detail here. Pretty well job there. So the pair of them head out to enjoy the rest of the festival. Why not me and I hold the fourth and some others in the classroom? The new visitor keep us busy for a few minutes, but business really has died down since the morning. I'm sure people are way more interested in the exhibits and attractions the other classes are putting on, on than what we're doing. Sir Kiyo, hmm? She is about to confess her love. Is she about to confess? Please. I need a I need a go for it. But I, but I realize I'm spacing out again as I hear not to me address me from behind. I just wanted to ask you Ask how you've been. Oh, yeah, good, I guess. Just going through the ma um, motions, you know. That's me, let's out a little chunk. Yeah, I know what you mean. Sucks that we've been so busy, huh? Why don't we in the culture fest and the exams? I hardly get to talk to you guys. Story, story of your life, huh? <laughs> oh, come on, don't be like that. <laughs> you know I'm teasing. She grins at me, and she she knows only too well that I can't really get mad at her. But I can get even. Sure, but I think that next customer customer is yours. Huh? Oh, 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 welcome. Please, take a seat, whatever you like. Just as she's about to attend to our latest guest, she stops in her tracks for a moment and looks back, to, back at me. Let's go look at the festival together when our... Friends are back, okay? Sayon and Hiriko return to will leave us before too long. Both of them grateful for a more subdued coffee atmosphere compared to the busy morning we just had. So I spent a little time with Notsumi looking at the attract uh, attractions the rest of the school put on for the festival. Ooh, nice background. But before there was time to head back, we found ourselves outside, away from the most of the hustle and bustle of the main event. Man, it feels weird to be all dressed like this. It's all part of the festival queue, you get used to it. I'm not sure sh I'm not so sure about that, to be honest. But I have more important things on my mind. Things that I suspect are on Notsumi's mind as well. So, the hypnosis show we did, we left an imp impression, didn't it? Yeah, you want to talk about it? She nods. I mean, I've barely been able to stop thinking about it. Just the thought that you had that the vice that we were sure could put me or anybody else into a hypnotic state with ease, and you could use it to plan all sort of crazy suggestion in our heads that we'd feel compelled to follow, no matter what. I know what we promised each other, and and I know you were true to your word, Q. I don't think you ever abused what you had. Um, I don't know about that, uh, you know, I, you know, those 
the past few episodes back, you know, back in the uh, uh, was a bit of questionable, you know. I I I I totally did abuse them. <laughs> But what if you did abuse it? That's, that's what I said. I did it. I, I did. I actually did. <laughs> like, when I play for the first time in Pit Night, I went to the freaking weird ending. Abuse it. What was stopping you from doing whatever you wanted in that time? Everyone's been so supportive of what we did back then. Mom, Sayuri, even Hugo. But the fact is, I put them all in danger and they have no idea. And the shameful truth is, it's not like I wasn't thinking about any of this at the time. There was a part of me that was getting excited at the thought you may betray me, may turn the light of yours on me and everyone else and... And, and what? She blushes as she unfurls her eyes and I guess I'm not gonna get a soul answer to that? I'm just so discouraged... <laughs> what the hell? I'm just so disgusted with myself, Kiyo. So she's still beating herself up about what could have happened, huh? Not to me that... I just don't know what's wrong with me. She needs to know she doesn't have to feel this way. Not to, Nothing's wrong with you, okay? That pale light, I still don't know how it happened. And after I bro broke it, I don't think we'll ever know. It was just a freaky... Totally unexpected thing that I'd be weird if we didn't get to tempt by what it could do for us. But we came out of here, didn't we? That thing's gone. It's never coming back. And, well, we're still here. We know what hypnosis is supposed to be like. And I think so does your mom and your friends. So please, don't be too hard on yourself now. I couldn't bear it if I ruin a hypnosis for you. I don't think you ruined it for me, Kyo. I think I may have ruined it for myself. After everything that happened, I think the love I had for it, for it may actually be gone. Are you sure that's true, not me? <laughs> Why wouldn't it be true? Yeah, what happened is, is still getting her down. But from what if, from what we've been through together, I have a good feeling she'll appreciate what I'm about to do for her. Well, there's a way to find out for sure. Put your hands together like this. I put my hands together in front of me and not to me. After pa pause, starts to mimic me. Now, hold them up in front of your face and extend your pointer fingers out nice and straight. <laughs> I don't know why this, this looks so cute. And the music in the background, god damn it. So beautiful. I don't know what this is supposed to prove. You know you can stop this at any time. You can certainly try on, or you may find yourself staring at that space in between your fingers. Right here where I'm pointing. Natsumi's eyes turn to focus on the spot between her pointed fingers, and immediately I start to take the finger I pointed wind and begin to circle it around her hands. You can try to pull your eyes away, or you may now find a growing force pushing your fing finger uh, fingertips towards each other, pushing harder and harder. Mm. My finger can continues to circle, while well, Natsumi started to quiver as she stares intently. She knows what I'm what I'm doing and she knows she can stop playing this game with me anytime she likes. I don't have that pen light anymore. And yet, in spite of that, that force becoming more and more powerful, pushing those finger trips of you closer and closer. Not to me and finding she wants this after all. And you can try to resist. You can try to pull your fingers away. But the more you try, the stronger the force becomes. The more you try, the stronger it becomes. And the deeper you'll fall into a hypnosis, the moment they touch. Keeping your feet planted firmly on the ground. Staying perfectly upright even when your finger touch and sleep. 
Oh, that actually worked. I stop my fingers. This has not to me helplessly touch uh, her tips together. And man, I'm am I happy that worked. Going deeper into this pleasant state of hypnotic trance, allowing yourself to enjoy this feeling, allowing yourself to relax all the way whilst staying nice and upright. It was a simple hypnotic induction, of course. So simple even Hiroko could do it. Because you do enjoy this, don't you, Natsumi? Y yeah. But all I needed to show Natsumi that her love of hypnosis is as strong as ever. Of course you do. And when I count up to three and snap my fingers, you're going to wake up from this trance, happy and refreshed. And watch more, when we arrive back in the class and when it's time to close the cafe, you're going to become the best maid this school has ever seen. You'll be friendly, happy, and eager to help our customers, so they will leave with the smiles on their faces, okay? Oh, why? Okay, this, this is so wholesome. Like, I know it's a bit weird, like the hypnosis thing, but like, it's like the wholesome way, you know? This is, this is cute. Okay. One, two, three, and wide awake. Let me let her eyelids open slowly as I step back. It was her in the outer room sun. It's only just now I realize it's been a while since I taught this, but she really is beautiful. I guess that's weird, but after all this time, I really just like that we've been able to hang out together like this. And it sure feels amazing being able to put that smile on her face. So I guess we should have head back now, huh? Yeah, the class needs needs its star maiden back. <laughs> well, we'll see about that. <laughs> she walks me in the spring back in her. Step as she heads back inside. And as I follow behind her, I have a feeling this afternoon is going to be a lot more fun for everyone. May we have many more days like this. Oh my god, that was beautiful. I wasn't expecting that ending, I'll be honest with you. I thought if I broke the pen, I would be mad or something. Like, not using anymore. But... This really... This really got me, not gonna lie. <laughs> it's it's just beautiful. This is actually very beautiful. I, I really don't have any words. This is... This... Phenomenon... Phenomenon... How do you spell that? <laughs> I don't know. But yeah, this... I am really, really glad I... I've got this far. I mean, there's plenty more to go. There's like, there's still more options to do and more endings, but this this ending has to be one of my favorite ending from Penlight. I really, really did like this one. Very wholesome, very beautiful, and also he he had the time to spend with uh, her friends, get to know each other, and that made me actually smile. You know. Uh, yeah, this this is really reminding me how I've how I first met my friends like in school because I was completely like new quiet kid there. It's just this is really bring bringing me back memories how I met my friends like Rodrigo and other ones as well. But Rodrigo was the one that. That made me feel more alive when I was in school because I always felt so. I had always like such anxiety to talk to people, but Rodrigo was always there beside me. So I really, I really appreciate for him to be there beside me. And also Danny, of course, we can't forget about it. Ah, good times, good times. But yeah, this really touched me for some reason. <laughs> Sorry, I've been babbling a lot. But yeah, um, well. I think I'm going to end the the video right here. Uh, don't worry, I'm still going to make like all, all the different endings. So uh, thank you guys for watching this video. I really appreciate it for you guys just being there and enjoying this penlight episodes. 
and there's two more to go so be ready for that i'm really really excited to <laughs> play more so yeah whoever made this mod, uh, mod whoever made this visual novel game man you're you're just amazing you're just your storytelling is just chef kish <laughs> but yeah see you guys in the next one bye bye